Hey guys, this is Gamer Italia and it's time for BAM! It's another unboxing and it's my second BAM box and I'm super excited. This month's theme was back to the 80s, I think, something like that. And I got it uh, this week when I was away, so I've been ex expecting this and it. I had uh, the... Uh, the postcard about this had arrived, so I just had to go to the post office and get it. It's a freaking BAM box! Uh, the damages on the box is definitely less than uh, last time. It is practically none. Uh, and they, I got a letter from the CEO of the BAM box. I just opened the box so I can tear it up. Uh, and they said that early looters or early subscribers pay what they usually, what they did from the beginning, the uh, early price. So I will keep paying $35 for this, or 40 ish because of the shipping. Uh, but later subscribers had to pay 29 in America, so uh, for the... Um, uh, international subscribers, it would be like uh, 39, 40, 45-ish, depending on the price where you, they have to ship the stuff. So, I don't really remember what I pay for this. Anyway, let's open the BAM! It's BAM! And the first thing we see is the PIN! Truffle Shuffles! What the heck is this? It, it's a pin. It's Truffle Shuffles. And I have no freaking idea what it is. It's a dude with a shirt and he shows his belly. That much I know. So I will read on, read some about that. So let's dig in. Paper. I saw a picture of these! I saw a picture of these! Sunglasses! I have a Cyclops! Cyclops sunglasses! Or maybe the Robocop visor sunglasses. But anyway. If I walked out like this, people were like, um, what the hell are you wearing? I don't think I wear this the right way. Um, I have no idea if I'm making it right. Maybe I need to check up on this. It's supposed to be like this, but it feels kind of weird. Because my eyes and nose is not symmetrical at all. So, this wearable item is freaking awesome. And, oh, oh, we got a print. I need to, to buy a frame. I need to buy a frame. Oh, 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 there's stuff. Why is there damages on this? Authenticity. This artwork is one of a kind authentic original piece of art that was used in the production of this carton. There are no two alike. <gasps> This is an actual drawing from whatever it is. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. I have no idea what this is from. But it is an actual. Oh my god! Lucasfilm animation. Star Wars droids. How could I not see this? How can I not see this big ass? There's, that's why there's some paint here and some paints here. This is the coolest thing ever. This is the coolest thing ever. Holy freaking crap. I definitely need to get a frame for this. No questions asked. And I can see that it's made 
from a uh, lead pencil. Because I can see the shining from the guest there. When when the sun hits it. Holy fri- This is the best thing ever in a box ever. And I have four <laughs> boxes only. Holy freaking crap. Okay. Okay. This one I need to check up on. It's tin plates. Li like a license plate slash barcode slash I have no idea. I need to check, read up on this. I'm going to be so careful with my, my drawing. And there's two prints in here. Who you gotta call? Ghostbusters! Of course. We can't have back to days without Ghostbusters. Rocky! This has gotta be the artist of this print. Certificate of Authenticity. I love that there's always a certificate of authenticity in these boxes. <gasps> no way! No way! Karate Kid, or Karate Kid, as we say in Sweden. Is it him or is it Daniel? Is it Daniel's son or this guy? No freaking way! Okay, I, I'm. Rocky Davis. <laughs> okay. Ralph Macchio. Karate Kid signed photo. From one of the most beloved movie franchises of the 80s come one of the most memorable moments, the crane kick. Poised to lose under the under 18 L All Valley Karate Tournament to Cobra Kai member Johnny Lawrence, Daniel LaRusso digs deep and assumes the crane stance, a technique he observed Mr. Miyagi perform on the beach. This iconic scene is captured in this photo and signed by Rolf Macchio, who played the Karate Kid himself. I don't know how the Bambox staff does this, but can they stop making me speechless all the time? Because I have lost my, all my words. Holy freaking crap. Um, Bambox exclusive. Rocky Davis signed print. Straight from the pen of Rock Rocky Davis comes this Bambox exclusive signed and number sli Slimer art print. Most will get the original Ecto Cola variant. Uh, no? Uh, most will get the original print, while 500 will receive the red one up card for the Ecto Cola var variant. Uh, I got the original, where he signed with the green pen. Uh, Rocky Davis was born in the late 70s, putting him in a prime position to absorb the full decade of 80s comics. Brilliance. He grew up on a pure diet of that era's cartoons, comics, video games, toys and movies. This eclectic inspiration led Rocky to constantly fill up sketchbooks, school papers and every surface he could find with superheroes, monsters, aliens and the like. He has worked with a variety of clients ranging, ranging from Disney to Nickelodeon to Tommy Hilfinger and Goldstein. Yeah. The band box just keep getting better and better every month and I just I have only yet got two boxes. This is amazing. 1980s back to the future prop replica license plate ah it's been so long since i saw this movie doc brown didn't stop at converting the delorean into a time machine he made sure it had a proper license plate 
You will receive either the iconic out of a time full size prop replica license plate or the barcode full size prop replica license plate from Back to the Future. So there's not really a one up card, it's just this one or the other. How could I not see that? Okay, uh, one at a time, one at a time. Breathe, breathe. Where did I put the sunglasses? There. Retro sunglasses. When the 80s are referenced, ref uh, referenced, we think of Valley Girls, pop music, and or pizzerias. Looking it up, seriously, they were amazing. But you can't think of the 80s without bringing up 80s fashion. And what better accessory to do done than the required sunglasses after an all night party. Thank you, New Way Punk. Okay, but I still think it's like a Robocop visor or a Cyclops visor. It doesn't matter if it's like really modern, 80 modern <laughs> sunglasses. I will still keep thinking Robocop or X Men. Exclusive Truffle Shuffle Pit. From artist Nick Kokosa comes one of the most nostalgic scenes from 80s movies, The Truffle Shuffle. This famous dance from Chunk in the hit movie The Goonies made it into this month's band box as the exclusive custom hat pin. Look out for the green, one up card for the black, and gold variant numbered out of 250. Doesn't matter which I got. It's weird. And and it's amazing. I got a Star Wars. Many of us can quote line after line of our favorite cartoons we watched growing up. For some, it was seen after the fact, but met with the same love. Nostalgia hits as we remembered quips and scenes from our favorite characters. And in this band box is a piece of that history. A hand-drawn original pencil sketch with studio markings used in the making of He-Man, She-Ra, the real Ghostbusters, Alvin and Chipmunks, Star Wars droids, Star Wars Ewoks, My Pet Monsters, or Back to the Future. This sketch was turned into animation in the cartoon series, cartoon series and is 100% authentic. This is a one-on-one uh, one one item and there's not another one like it in the world. I totally lost wars. I I had this episode all pl planned. I was gonna open the box and then I was going to show you the bag I bought for all my pins and I would put the pin on that bag but I have no words. Not only I got a signed photo of the Karate Kid himself. I got an original drawing. I'm totally lost for words. I don't know what to say. I'm The band box just keeps getting better, and as I said, I only got two of them, and I'm super excited that I actually signed up for them, because otherwise I would never have gotten this stuff. This is amazing. This is the bag that I got for my pins, and as you see, this is, uh, this here is uh, last month's BAM box pin, and here you have Loot Grid pins, and here is the school pin that I graduated from. <sighs> Thank you, Bambox, that I am, um, that I get to be a part of this. I can't thank you enough for all these amazing things I get. Um, right now, I only have two, bo two boxes subscribed to. But I have several that I want to subscribe to. 
and I've seen the contents of some of them. But right now, there's no box ever in the world that can beat BAM box. We got three prints, as you can say. Four with the tin. Three prints. One is an original drawing. Three certificate of authenticity. And this is also signed by John Lowman from AIA. I am so lost for words. So I'm gonna stop here before I start screaming my lungs out because I have nothing else to say but thank you so much Bambox and I'm sorry for everyone out there who isn't subscribed to Bambox because they missed out on some super incredible things this month and with that I'm going to stop here and say I hope you, ha you guys subscribe to Bambox and don't miss out on this because no matter what I pay there's nothing in the world that these things are worth so much more than what I pay not only in money, real money but uh, also in real value for me Uh, the only sad part is, from this drawing, you can't see it because the light is so bad. Um, I never watched this cartoon because I'm not an 80s kid, I'm a 90s kid. But I really need to see it now. I definitely have to see it now. So I will check it out. I will check it out and look it up and I will watch every episode. And I hope you guys 